All right, Tony Tavares here, Classic Physique Pro. I am here with MPC News Online at the Republic of Texas Pro Show, and I am here with physique competitor. Myron Griffin, oh. Six Day Pro. All right, what was that? Six Day Pro. Okay. That's okay. my handle. Okay, I see you, I see you. All right, so coming into this show, I know you did Sacramento, I believe. How did you do in that show? What was your feedback from the judges, and how did you go about making those improvements? So that was about a month ago. The show was a month ago. I got third next to Joe Manji and Ciroc. My feedback from Sandy was to you know work on my posing, my front pose, and that's all I've been doing is working on my front pose. So I'm excited to show that I can listen, that I can bring to the table what they're expecting me to bring to the table and put it all on the line. All right, all right. So what would you say, you got third, which is, which is great. What would you say is uh, your number one strength coming into this show here? I believe my number one strength is my back. Uh, I've been working hard on it. Um, yeah, I just, I get a lot of good, good input, uh, feedback from my back. So yeah, I would say it's my back. All right. Yeah. All right. Any adversity in particular that you've had to overcome this year going into Sacramento or coming into this show, um, that you had to overcome in terms of mentally, you know, it, I've been blessed because it's been a pretty smooth uh, year so far. Okay. So, uh, last year we had, you know, ups and downs with COVID and everything, but this year, you know, Thank you, God. It's been it's been it's been a smooth ride. My girlfriend's been helping me out a lot. You know, my coach. So really, no adversities, no no challenges. You know, I, I mean, I want to knock on some wood now, but yeah, yeah it's been a pretty good ride. So good. yeah. Good. Who is your coach, and uh, how do you guys go about attacking your peak week? I know a lot of competitors are always interested about this. You know, how do you go about carving up? I know you guys don't have a weight you have to hit like us. So tell us who your coach is, and how do you go about attacking a peak week? So my coach is David Suggs. He goes Suggs. This is his handle on uh, on Instagram. But um, yeah, my my. I'm a little bit different, I would like to say, but we, we've been working together for two years and he knows my body in and out. So what I do is not really, you know, I can't give advice to everybody else, but what I do is, you know, I'm, I'm very carb sensitive. So I don't even carb until the almost, like my first carb meal was a few minutes ago. So I'm starting to feel the effects now. Yeah. And this is the day before the show, you know, I don't know what time it is, like seven o'clock at night, eight o'clock at night. Yeah. Most people start carbing up in the morning so I mean it's all it's all different, but it, when when you're carb sensitive, I believe you want to stay away from carbs as much as you can to the last minute, and then start carbing up at the last minute. That's what seems to be working for me, and that's what Coach we kind of got together and figured it out, and yeah. it's been a good, big, big, a good showing. Yeah. yeah. And, and for those that maybe don't really know what that means, carb sensitive, what does that do to your body if you eat too many carbs in terms of what we're looking at on stage? That's a very, very, very good question. So carb sensitive and what it does to your body is if you eat too early and you're trying to peak right, you could get that spillover. And what spillover means is when you're when you're doing a pose, you kind of see your belly kind of spilling over, as they say. Mm -hmm. And if you if you don't carb right, if you don't peak right and you're carb sensitive, you do a little bit too early, maybe even a little bit too late, however it works for you. But you can get that spillover. You can go flat. Um, you can be over over pumped, so there's a lot of things that you have to really take uh, take into consideration yeah. about carbs, and that's why you got to get a good coach to really figure out your body because everybody's different. Absolutely. So, last question: What is your true expectation in your head? Everyone's got a vision. Everyone's got a goal. What is your goal coming into this show? Well, absolutely, 100% trying to manifest it. I'm trying to go to Olympia this year. So I really have a strong feeling that I'm going to win the show. Myron Griffin, look out for me. Remember the name because it's my time. Manifest it. Put it in the atmosphere. Let's go, baby. All right. You heard him. You can manifest anything in this life if you follow it up with the right action. Some people forget that piece. The action is most important. Go rock it with action tomorrow. Go kill it. All right. Yes, sir. Nice meeting you, brother. Nice to meet you. Absolutely.